Welcome everybody to our groundbreaking ceremony for the Williamsburg Sports and Events Center. Um, you know, this is an exciting moment for all of us. I want to start by saying thank you to the elected officials and various people who have been a part of this project since the beginning. The historic Triangle members are neighbors. We're friends, and by working together, we were able to get to today. And I'm very proud of all the staff and everybody who worked to do this. Because what it means, especially to me, when I see people coming together, when I know that children are going to come and play here, their families are going to come, when I know that our residents are going to come and enjoy the area, that's what helps to make this a community. And we are a community. And because we are a community, this has come to fruition. We are taking another huge step by joining together with the city of Williamsburg, York County, and building this sports and events center. We will attract large tournaments and events to our community with increased overnight stays and return visits. By building the sports and events center, we are investing not only in the future of our young people, but we are investing in the citizens by providing additional recreation space and by broadening our tax base. Now it's time for a new tourism investment that builds on the last 100 years of Williamsburg success. Today, we embark on our generation's investment in the greater Williamsburg area and break ground on this Williamsburg Sports and Events Center. In the city of Williamsburg, we say big ideas live here. This type of big thinking is only possible when people reach beyond assigning credit or pushing the conventional practices and persist through political pressures. We talk about partnership and yet I think the three communities compete with each other at times. So seeing them come together and doing something special like this is just a phenomenal, um, phenomenally good event. Fortunately, as I've said before, the community came together. The community of Yorktown, James uh, City County, and the city of Williamsburg. And that's what it's all about because we are the historic triangle after all, and why should we not work together? And you know what they say, in unity there is strength, okay? Well, if you put three jurisdictions together, look at the strength that you have. A lot of folks don't really understand the effect of tourism. One of the nice things is that people come and they leave. When they come, they spend a lot of money, okay, which uh, generates businesses for that locality. And that money can also be used in education, government support, roads, uh, commerce, and it, it enhances the quality of life within the region. So tourism is probably one of the cleanest, nicest businesses you can have because it's such a positive for a community. This is a great example of a rising tide lifts all boats. While it might be uh, located in the city of Williamsburg, just up the street, less than two tenths of a mile, is a row of hotels. They're all York County. And so that's significant. So it has great implications for us as well. I mean, what it really means to the, to the community is, is a new opportunity for economic development, for recreation, for our own residents, there, there's a lot of benefits that will come with this project. We're really looking forward to see it built coming back in 2026 and cutting the ribbon on it. 